Hi, it's Danielle from Down to Funky Faces and Balloons and today we are going to be learning to do Queen Bee LOL doll. They're still popular, I hear. So what you will need is 350 mocha, blow it up halfway, chrome for the hair, gold 260 and 160 mocha for the arms and the legs and the fourth balloon uh, this is for the dress, just a 260 black. So first of all, we are going to do the head. So put that five finger bubble, and then into the ear twist, and then matching it up, five finger bubble, and another ear twist. This, and then putting that, and wrapping it around, Quite tight. Don't like to see the joins. Uh, we need some of this to um, slack to add it onto the dress. So I'm just going to cut this bit off here. Tie it off and pull that over to the other ear. But I put my thumb underneath so it's not so tight so we can grab it again. So there we go. Like this. Try not to lose it this time. I lost it on my other video. Right now we're gonna attach the hair. So we need the chrome. And we're just going to wrap that into the ear twist. And we're gonna make a like a parting. So we want to go halfway. So it's a four finger bubble, three or four, and then over to the other side like this and then we're gonna do a one finger bubble or actually it's more two finger bubble and do a pinch twist this is gonna be her bobble so after you've done the pinch twist you then need to do a loop twist squeeze the air along just a little one, like so, and then another pinch twist, so that's two pinch twists. Now we want to bring it over to here, where we think it looks nice, so I think that's about a three finger bubble, maybe four, and then I'm going to do a pinch twist. And this is going to be her other hair bobble. So then you want to do a loop twist. So, you see, so it's going like this and we're going to do another pinch twist here. So there's two pinch twists. There we go. And Probably need a little bit less air than what I put in originally, so maybe leave seven fingers. Another spacer bubble and then into the ear. Oh, one of my pinch twists is coming down. Going back to do the spacer into the ear. Okay, because this is quite tight now. hair this is the longest bit of her hair and then we want to bring it back across the back like this and then we don't need it anymore so that's all we needed for that that is a bit crazy <laughs> there we go. right we want to get rid of this and I'm just gonna wrap it around the ear so this is what you should have possibly need to do it in a little bit smaller like that okay now for the dress and the body so we need the 260 black and we want to make a 
three finger bubble. This is going to be her midriff. And then we need two pinch twists for the neck. One. Two. And then, coming back down. Now we want this to be quite tight because we're going to wrap this in. And then I like to go back up to the pinch twist to make it safe. So we wrap it in and under. And then wrap around the pinch twist. So you have this. Now we need to attach her arms. So you need the 160 mocha and wrap it around one of the pinch twists. I then like to just see the right length. Watch this. Four finger bubble just so it comes back down to here and back up again. So we have this now. Okay. Now we need to do something a little bit fiddly and that is squeeze the air out of this because we want to bring it back down to this join. Okay. So push all the air out. Squeeze. Oh. in the face. Right, so then we brought it back down to where we want to do her legs. And I'd say it was about four. They've got tiny little legs. We shan't be attaching shoes this time because we're making it quite fast. And wrap that around the 260. Okay, so you're wrapping that around like that. Now, we want to do a small bubble in the black and then another small bubble but make the second bubble a pinch twist and now I'm gonna we're gonna wrap the skirt around back around to the pinch twist so squeeze it there we're wrapping it around and back you see what we're doing there and then this wraps around the pinch twist Okay, so we have a very cute little dress. I know she has like gold lines on it, but the child isn't going to realise. I mean, you, if you've got a gold pin, go ahead, do some squiggly white lines, but I would probably just leave it like this. And snap that off. And wrap that around. We want to get rid of this bit, unless they want to hold it like that. <laughs> so let's get rid of this bit. And I would wrap it around the pinch twist just to be, you don't even have to tie it in a knot, but I will. But just wrap it around that pinch twist. And so you should have this. Two pinch twists, two three finger bubbles, a spacer bubble, pinch twist, and the loop around here. So now all we've got to do is attach your head. A very big head. So we find a scrap and then we just plop a head on. Okay. She's looking kind of cute. She just needs a face. So let's do the artwork. So first of all I would start with drawing some black circles that are quite big. One here and another one here and then we just want to colour those in like so. Squig it. Another one. And then we need to do like moon moon shapes. So we outline just from the middle to there. So that's round about the middle. 
coming all the way in to there and we want to do that one more time so that's the middle sorry for my very squeaky pen and then we want to do from the middle coming round again like this and then we need to do a little nose and some little lips and some eyebrows oh they are not on fleek there we go now I'm going to color first of all I'm going to show you how to do the highlight so on lol they have a big highlight here and then a little one a big one here and then a little one I think I need a new white pen and then this bit's going to be white and then here is going to be white now this would be pretty good enough to give the child now but i'm going to just this is why my pens run out <laughs> not put the lid on right i'm going to go brown and brown coming around here and i think i'm going to give her a little bit of lipstick Oh, I didn't give her any eyelashes. Just give her some eyelashes. Our very beautiful little girls. And there we go. Here is the LOL face. So here are the queen bees. And I think they look ultra cute. If there's any LOL that you'd like to learn, maybe message me, see see what we could do for a quick line work LOL. Um, but I think any little girl would love these. So remember to like, subscribe, to uh, watch more tutorials that will be coming up soon. Thank you for watching.